Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Pacific Tomb, and I'm bringing you guys more Call of Duty Black Ops 2 gameplay. Today I'm going to be using the Scorpion Evo, and I believe I'm using the Laser Sight and Extended Mags, or it's Fast Mags. Either way, this gun is an absolute monster. I'm going to be using Ghost with Flak Jacket, Dexterity, um, Scavenger, and Toughness. And this is pretty much my staple. Uh, actually, I'm using Extended Mags with the uh, the Red Dot Sight. But I came up with a beastlier class for the Scorpion. You do bleed ammo, in a sense, but that's what the point of Scavenger is for. And it's also going to be something that you're going to use on a very close quarters map. This is taken from release night, so a lot of these guys are really, really, really bad. I believe I also had host in this gameplay, and I was playing with people all on the East Coast. So, obviously, these kids got absolutely boo-booed on. They ate boo-boo snacks. Um, hot, warm boo-boo snacks. <laughs> That's so fucking disgusting. Anyway, what I wanted to talk about in this gameplay is actually building your kill streaks and being able to get orbital resets consistently and also being able to get your score streaks consistently, especially these high ones. So I know that a lot of people haven't been able to get the VTOL warship. A lot of people haven't been able to get the VSAT unless they pretty much just camp objectives for it. But I have ghosts, therefore I can rush around. So basically what I usually do is I, um, I cap the home flag and then I rush to B or whatever other flag and then I watch the flank routes while I cap that flag and I also make sure that if I'm anywhere near the middle of the map I'm standing on the B flag so that I can get the points for shooting somebody who's trying to come cap the B flag or someone who's shooting at me if I win the gunfight that means I get 125 points and then I can pick up my kill streaks. And also, I believe if you're standing on the flag or if you call in a kill streak on the flag, I think that that actually does add to your score streak. It increases the amount of points that you get. So here you can see I'm already up in my VTOL warship. I already called the Blackbird in, and I was able to pick up these score streaks really, really quickly. And the reason for that is because of the amount of points and the objectives that I was playing. Now, a lot of you guys may not like objective play, but if you guys want to get these streaks and you want to get this gameplay and you want to get the W, this is exactly how you have to play. You have to move. And that's one of the main reasons why I have on Ghost. Even if you guys, you know, if you, even if you guys strafe back and forth, Ghost still works. So you're able to, you know, you're still able to, to move and everything. And I'm not entirely sure how my VTOL actually survived that, uh, that rocket shot there, but... And you can see one of the main points of this map that's really, really camped is uh, Reactor Room. And that's one of the things that I don't like about this map in particular. People like sitting over there. And as you can see, I pick up another 30-point UAV assist for the V-Set. And I die off my Lightning Strike. So uh, the Lightning Strike is a very good killstreak setup. And not the Lightning Strike. The setup that I'm using right now is a very good killstreak setup. I'm using the Lightning Strike, the Orbital V-Set, and the VTOL Warship. The reason that this is so good is because you pick up assists from almost anything. If you almost damn near damage somebody with a lightning strike, you get points for that assist that comes in. You get points for those bullets that somebody else shoots at them. Also, I would like to mention that the Scorpion Evo has the nastiest hip fire in this game. If you guys would like to see a class setup video of the really, really OP, stupid, ridiculous, rapid fire setup that I have on the Scorpion, I'll be more than happy to make that for you guys. If you guys give this video 250 likes, I'll be more than happy to make a class setup video of one of my favorite ARs and one of my favorite SMGs. And the favorite SMG is going to be the Scorpion, and the other one is going to be the M8A1. So, uh, with all of that said, the last thing that I want to talk about in this gameplay is the fact that you can get these killstreaks with consistency if you know exactly who you're playing against, if you know how they're playing, if you know you know what maps they like to run usually what I do is I stay in the lobby with my friends um, probably two or three times just to get a feel for the lobby see how they're playing see if I have to change my killstreak setups if you play against a party or if you play against a few people and you realize that they're camping then you may need to lower your killstreaks because you're not gonna get them out of their buildings with a lodestar a warthog and you know dogs or a swarm or anything like that because I, if you guys also notice, dogs are a whole lot better in this game because they also have on ballistic vests or, or you know, shock vests or whatever. So there you can see I pick up another lightning strike. And here's here again is where I'm talking about how this thing's an absolute monster. Me and my teammates steamroll these kids. And the reason for that is because of the orbital V set. So this is exactly why the orbital V set is key to your success in this game. It's also key to your success to getting your defense, your point streaks, and actually just having an overall good time playing this game. 
you'll also notice that some of these people rage quit i'm really hoping that they like these people level up fast enough so they don't rage quit anymore because i'm tired of getting my streaks and then having bitches leave when i'm gonna get a gameplay so i hope you guys enjoyed this commentary i hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay my final score was i believe 40 and 3 i know it's a low scoring gameplay but i still got five captures and 10 defends hope you enjoyed i ptfo i'm out peace